a UFC featherweight division fight. All right, crowd getting excited as this fight gets underway, and you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist, but on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true five-tool player. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Big call punch land. Now he gets back to range. Over and over, he lands with big body kicks. That right hand hurt him a little well, bit. Well, that one should leave a mark. Outstanding leg kick employed there by Lee. Switching stances here. Head kick attempt, unable to find the target. A oh, little single collar tie there. Lee's got the tie clinch. Let's see what he can do with it. Ooh, looking to set up the head kick, but he misses. He got to whip his hip into that kick. Lee gets touched by that leg kick attempt. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Big head kick. Oh, nice combination of kicks there by Lee. When you're in a clinch, you can pull down on the head and land this beautiful punch to the head. Lands flush with that right hand. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. All right, that horn signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are gonna be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, DC, here we go with our next round. It wasn't just the accuracy, it was the aggressiveness, the volume. It was unbelievable to watch him be so active. The cardio, the push, the pace, and the pressure that he fought with. It's gonna be very interesting to see if he can maintain this over 15 minutes. Oh, that couldn't have felt good as he lands the knee to the body. He's a tall fighter and he's gonna have the size advantage against most opposition in this division. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Another punch to the head. He's really turning every part of himself into those strikes to the head. He lands another punch to the head. Big kick lands. Trying to establish that jab once again. Straight left counter is true. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, looked like he might have been in range, but misses with the kick. Less than a minute to go now in round two. Stand after you take a head kick like this, that is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Oh, bleeding from his cheek now. That can't feel good. He's digging his entire weight into those punches to the body. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. And maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability.
Third round underway. Able to check that kick as well. Tonight. The biggest shot that he's landed all night. A massive uppercut lands. Straight punch lands. And both guys really throwing with authority. It's such a fast leg kick. Oh, good job defensively there to block the strike by Lee. Way to hide that leg kick. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Oh, lands another beautiful strike to the body, really starting to connect at will when it comes to work in the body, and especially effective doing it later in this fight. Didn't see a lot of that from him in the earlier rounds. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Slips the left hand. Just out of the range with that right hand. Nice punch there. Oh! Oh! Oh, and he lands another huge knee there as the taller fighter uses his length well yet again. Oh, timely hook. Oh, straight right. If you take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Kicks. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. All right, a lot of tremendous striking action in that last round, DC. I know you don't have a Telestrator, but take us through the replay. I mean, I would love to have my Telestrator right now. That was a great display of high-level mixed martial arts striking. Both combatants stood toe-to-toe -to -toe and let it all hang out. to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Wow, what a head kick. That was a thudding leg kick. That's a big strike right there. Oh, a huge block there. Look at that leg. Oh, and a nice jab by him there, and that's gonna give his opponent some problems if that keeps landing. He's having a tough time getting his offense going because that jab is just stopping him every time. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Oh, big punch land. Oh, single collar tie here. Oh, he eats a knee. And there comes the separation now. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, nice. Yeah, left hook found its target. Big kick land. All right now we take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides, really. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did, and they both found success over the course of that round. It is the fifth and final round. Lee gets caught with that punch. 
Well, he put so much stock into this fight, and now we're late in the game, and if he doesn't get a finish, this opportunity goes by the board. I mean, it's almost over. Right now, he's got to start throwing everything he can find at his opponent and hope that he can force a mistake and overwhelm his opponent to try to get a finish. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. But how about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Real quick leg kick. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. Circling to his right. Under one minute remains in round five. Again, back into this position. Well, you've got to admire the urgency here. He is trying to keep the judges out of it, lighten up his opponent left and right. 30 seconds now to go in the fight. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. What else can you say but what a fight?